As much as I love fishing, customer orders often take most of my time. While my handline reels have sold well over the past two seasons, it's unusually hard on my equipment. Alright, so how to use voiceover. Voiceover in your YouTube videos. What, what is voiceover? Voiceover narration, you've seen it. And you've heard it in documentary films and even in some major film, like River Runs Through It. Go back and rewatch River Runs Through It. Robert Redford's doing the narration and voiceover there. It's his older self giving a little bit of narration. It's almost like an old man telling his own story. And narration can be a great way to convey information quickly. You know, sometimes there's a type of cinema called verite cinema or direct cinema where you just turn on the camera and just watch everything unfold but some things they say a picture is worth a thousand words sometimes a few words are worth a thousand pictures sometimes because I could sit here and shoot an hour worth of footage of just showing me doing something and you still have no clue as to what I'm doing it's boring you go somewhere else right if I just put in a couple of sentences of voiceover or narration or even just putting some text on the screen that sort of explains the time to date and what I'm doing and why I'm doing it. It works. It's a great way to enhance your videos. One of the problems though is people have used it too much. Think about back when you were in seventh grade in health class and you watched those boring documentary films about health or something and just made you want to go to sleep. All right. The last thing you want in your videos is for it to be a lecture. Now what we're doing here, this is in fact a lecture. Talking head videos are by definition lectures, but I'm talking about in your storytelling and in your fishing videos or your outdoors videos, whether you're climbing a mountain, mountain biking, fishing, hunting, trapping, anything. Voiceover can add something to your videos, especially to set the premise of a story as in what you just saw with the sugar fly there. It works, you know, it's, um, Test, 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 one, two, one, two. Uh, voiceover, voiceover, sugar fly. This is, um, no, yes, this is for sugar fly, but it's also for the, um, what is it, the the video on trying to teach voiceover methods. Uh, what, what's the... It adds some, see, if it's all talking head, people get bored. If it's all just, hey, watch me go fishing, people get bored. If it's all just music over B-roll, people get bored. If it's all just voice over B-roll, people get bored. As much as I love fishing, so as much as I love fishing, I'd rather customer orders take up much of my time. Yeah, that's it. All right, take one. As much as I love fishing, customer orders often take most of my time. That's a good take. Try another one. If you take all those things and mix them up in a way that tells a story, beginning, middle, end, and you use them in the right proportions, you add one more dynamic to your videos that makes it far more pleasant to watch than just talking heads like this. Uh, I forgot my line. That's why I add from time to time voiceover or narration some to my fishing videos or even just lower thirds with text. Add something. And as a result, I've, as I have done voiceover sometimes, people seem to like my voice and the way it sounds, especially in the mornings. Take three or four or seven, I don't know, whatever. While my handline reels have sold well, over, sold well, sold well over tongue twister um i want to offer a, a voiceover service voiceover narration service i'm trying to flesh that out 
and uh, if that sounds like something interested to you post down below and we can talk if you have something that you want to record my voice maybe you want an intro maybe you want an outro uh, hey click subscribe that kind of thing or an intro to your videos you have a special project you want to use and that's one of the services I want to offer here on YouTube here <laughs> on my website let me know what you think and I plan on offering it on the website and let me know what you think if you're interested ah I gotta go turn some more reels Thank you.